last week of what is said to be the latest technological advancements in solar panels. What's really of note is the overwhelming amount of energy they're capable of generating. I'm still not entirely sure what they are for or their purpose, but I have an idea. There have been rumors circulating about some of the activities going on in the building, but our superiors discourage any questions. I don't believe. I don't believe what? What does it believe? Right, see if we can take anyone out of this drone before he gets wasted. So we've got to be in there and do all that. Uh, let's try being long lethal, shall we, this time? Come on. Come on. Oh yeah. That was a piece of piss. Yeah, there is no camera. I've got no camera. I'm not on my setup. into a live stream. These oh, feeds yeah. are from a sub basement under the server room. Anyone up for some light entertainment? You see, it contains a chemical cocktail, botulinum, conotoxin, succinicholine. Well, we're going with the specifics if you wouldn't even understand. Let's just say it took a lot of trial and error to get the mix right. Wouldn't want the killing too quickly or contaminating the organs. This is where they implant the microchip. Test them. Bagley, capture all this footage. It's all going into my case file. Here's another. I'm glad to see they're trying to keep things sterile. Don't want to risk infection. One oh more. At issue are the strong convulsions triggered by the microchips and concern over the possibility of damaging the valuable merchandise, the eyes being the most vulnerable. Initial findings indicate that the microcharge may be the problem. Although the damage to the lower stem is minimal, it is enough to trigger strong convulsions in approximately okay, 30 cases. That's enough. Cases. Let's do something about this. Yeah, let's do something about it. One second. Yes. There we go. I tend not to try and speak through all this anyway, so it'll work out a little bit better. Oh crap. Let's get the arm there. Where's this sitting then? Mate, if you, you know, you've got pl like, you know, plenty it's of games to play in the game, so well this, this is a lie on your list, then yeah. 
Don't stress too much about it. Uh, we'll hijack this. Download that. Open this. Time to put Mary Kelly's operation on ice. Let's blow some shit up. You took the words right out of my mouth. I think I was not meant to come down here until later on, but I just kind of like jumped down here, shall I? We need to head back. Are we kidding me? Man, I hate doing this stuff. Um, is there a, yeah, there's a proper camera up there, good. Spin you round. What's going over here then? A oh, joy, a oh, joy. Find the up camera. What, what am I missing then? Because blue all around there, blue here, oh, red there. Ah, uh, this should do it. There we go. Your jokes are not funny. Just leave the area before the same thing happens to you, alright? Oh, I forgot he has an insta takedown, doesn't he? You need to find what this is, though, man. It says it's down there. Just get it later. Yeah, you can sort of shoot me for one. Get out! Use your legs. Slaves and more like potential witnesses. We should apprehend her before she turns them into definite corpses. We can't risk that happening. It might throw a spanner in Caitlin's plans. But we need to help those last few people she's threatened. The Kelly's stronghold is at the Sandstone residence. I've marked it on your map. Sign this there, guys. Alright, so two minutes was better off going for the drone anyway. Very nice. It's done. 
Yeah, check this out. Yeah. Come on. Jesus. Right. Well, at least the chips are disabled. Mary has sealed herself in her office downstairs, but the mainframe will repower the elevator. Oh, and guards are on the lookout, so do try to survive. Grant, just Grant. And it's like, yeah, they're obviously going to charge me and I'm the leg for it. So, not in a moment, please. Stay near the mainframe long enough so I can reactivate the lift in Mary's office. Bloody chips don't work. I'm in my office. Come exterminate the Fermi. I can't do my job because I'm distracted. Firing at me. I don't need no fucking microchip to gut you, you filthy bastards! <laughs> Dead sick, is it? At least your timing's good. The Mets coming to take you in. Oh, I am counting on it, love. Everyone freeze! Back away from her. Mary Kelly, you're under arrest. Take me in, Inspector. I throw myself on the mercy of the bleeding court. I don't plan on me staying around very long. You lot! I gave you purpose when this city spit you out! <laughs> we'll be seeing each other again very soon. Stop! You don't think she's gonna let you scum take her white whale? Who are you protecting? The system for the people. Promise us. Promise us she won't go free. Go. I'll take you. 
take care of this. Thing is, he was just going to get out and do it again. Well, that's like you got your wish. Mary won't be walking away from this or anything else. I wanted to do this the right way, but after everything I've seen, I, uh, I guess I couldn't let her live. She had it coming, lad, and it's all she deserved what? for the lives she destroyed. For Angel, you did the right thing. You treat enough people like animals, and eventually they'll show you their teeth. Mm. Fuck Mary Kelly. She had this coming. I don't know. That was some version of justice, but not mine. At least, I didn't think it was when we started all of this. Well, the Queen may be dead, but there are plenty of Tan Kelly peons willing to take up the mantle. You're right about that, Vasily. I will keep my ear to the ground. I hear about more Clan Kelly shenanigans, you'll be the first to know. The thing is, she wouldn't have redeemed herself. She wouldn't have carried on. She would have a lot to redeem on, but she wouldn't have been able to redeem herself. There's only so far you can go before you can say you can't redeem no more. This game's kind of got a bit of a moral code to it at the moment, isn't it? It's kind of like. It makes you think. <laughs> Ping back the IP, sending us the dis. Miss? <laughs> Roy, you're five seconds before I snap whatever this thing is in half. It's a crypto phone. It's secure. Every device on CTOS can be compromised. If we're overheard, we're dead. Both of us. Who would have focused this? Not important. What matters is that I have inside information on SIRS. And I believe the people who framed you are rogue officers. And loath as I am to say it, dead sec may be my only hope to stop them. All right. You got me attention. Good. I hit coordinates to a meeting place on a device in that establishment. Sabine, has burped. Can you get Sorry, about. All right, that's a wrinkle. So this SARS bloke says Zero Day are a bunch of Secret Service dickheads. I mean, I suppose it does make sense. <laughs> the bombings were too sophisticated for randos, but SARS could pull it off. Officially, SIRS, or the Signal Intelligence Response Service, uses surveillance data drawn from CTOS to identify large scale terrorist and criminal threats. Then they send Albion to shoot the threats in the face. For example, and in the wake of escalating violence in London, the SIRS is extending the right to use lethal force to law enforcement and Albion securities. Unofficially, SIRS uses your data to read your mind and arrest you for having naughty thoughts. So we have means and opportunity, which leaves motive. SARS are fascist pricks, but they're supposed to stop groups like Zero Day from doing terrorist shite. Why cause one? When you meet this guy, ask. That CS cunt's not here. And it looks like there was an altercation. SIRS might be onto him. If you get access to the area's surveillance infrastructure, I can rebuild the scene in AR. All right. I'll give it a go. Oh, God. Watchdogs do like to use this, don't they, quite a lot? Are you kidding me? It's all over here now. Oh yeah, Raz, did you get my message by the way about Shadow of War? Alright, there we 
gag. We're in. We did it. That's done it. Then I'll reconstruct what happened to our contact. I love that. That appears to be our contact. Where? Where? Oh, there. Jesus. Yes, it certainly doesn't look like his best day, does it? Analyze the clues in the AR workspace to find out what happened to him. This is a non-lethal weapon, so odds are he's still alive, though he may not want to be. They've taken our SIRS contact away, but they may still be nearby. I can reconstruct the vehicle's path from unsecured CCTV recordings. That should allow you to follow it. Oh, that's cool. So we're Batmaning it. Not in Battle with Arkham Knight, where you've got to reconstruct the whole thing that happens to Barbara. The reconstruction's nearly finished, and so's our contact if you don't hurry. He's up here then, okay. What the hell, man? It looks like our contact assailant stopped here, but I can't see them nearby. Let's analyze the data to see if we can find out where they went. CTOSAR, data reconstruction in progress. It's not vehicles. Our contact assailants are switching vehicles to elude pursuers, which is standard operating procedure for private military perks like Albion. Mercs? Huh. We thought they'd be serious. What can I tell you? They're mercenaries. If you keep looking, you might find out why they're interested in an SRS whistleblower. I've completed a thorough analysis of the vehicle and concluded it is a van. Ha ha. What else? Well, I could also <laughs> mention that the minute traces of sand in the tire tracks indicate that it's been on a construction site recently. But you know me, hate to sound like a smart ass. I've been scanning nearby construction yards for Albion activity and, long story short, some dozy git has forgotten to turn off the security camera in the makeshift torture room. Let's see it then. Up. He's gonna die, and we're gonna have no idea why. Bagley, coordinates now. What are you there, buddy? Well, because I ran into a freaking pillar.
Come on, follow me. Hey, you're not a wank stain. Where's the key card? Wait, the key card's in the room? Oh crap. Didn't mean to use this gun. Did not mean to use this gun. Get him away, Jaren. <laughs> okay, what was that about? No! Don't get in! Yeah. Make it look like we're working here. Easy. I'm with Dead Sick. You called us. Of course. You shouldn't have come here. Now I don't know for sure. I've betrayed them. Come on now, we're just here. No, you've you. just damned us both. Look at him. I'll upload the intelligence onto an anonymous FTP. They'll explain everything. Actually, I'd like you to explain everything. Hmm. My name is Richard Malik. I'm an intelligence analyst. I believe Zero Day are rogue SIRS officers who framed you for the bombings to seize power. Now they're murdering or blackmailing anyone who threatens them, which now somehow includes me. Okay. Bagley will see about the intel. Just don't make me regret this. That I can't promise. Malik has made his way out, and now I suggest you do the same. As far as I didn't use this guy to like literally just infiltrate places. I am of course going to literally um like once I complete this game, I'm just gonna go through the whole map and just like clear everything. So if you see me leaving any notes or anything, it's literally just because I'm just spies, but waiting. You strike me as a sincere guy. Let's check out him intel at least. All right, one second. Bagley, check his intel, then get everyone together for a briefing. Please relax. <laughs> Please, thank you. Ow, my neck. Look, just to be on the safe side, I think we should walk away from this. Respectfully, I disagree. He needs our help. May I present the third option? Just use him. An SRS whistleblower, even one you don't trust, could still help us find the arsehole that blew up half of London and framed DedSec for it. You don't have to invite him to your birthday, just use his information. Solid plan. Fine. 